Uh, this is an Illuminarch flood fixture. What we use this for is lighting up buildings and trees outdoors. It's an IP rated fixture, which means it can get rained on, and it's also powered by LED um, light sources. Now, the LED light sources have red, green, blue, amber, and white in them. What that means is we can choose pretty much any color we want and get the color rendition spot on. So that's very different from how it used to be where we would have used a single white fixture and then put color gels in front of it. So this is very, very flexible like that. It also allows for DMX input. What that means is that the lighting designer can control the color um, digitally and away from the desk, and they can do that in conjunction with other lighting fixtures. For example, they might want the building to change color at the same time that maybe a gobo moves across the building for argument's sake. Um, downside of this particular fixture, it's a little bit narrow in its beam, which is really good if you want to uplight a really, really tall building. But if you're trying to wash a larger building or trees, um, sometimes the beam's a bit narrow. We can put frost filters on that to make it a bit wider, but it's not ideal. So if we're doing wider floods, we might use a different fixture. Um, the other downside of these um, fixtures, they're quite big and heavy, which for outdoor use can be okay, but sometimes they're a bit chunky for some spaces. So for those applications, we might use a smaller, lighter, or, or even a battery-powered fixture.